Ya. His great idea was that it would be faster and easier to get to Asia by sailing west across the Atlantic than to try and sail around Africa. In theory, Columbus's idea would have worked. What he never expected to find was a new continent. In 1484, Columbus tried to sell his idea to the Portuguese king. King Joao II refused the idea. In 1492, Queen Isabella agreed to sponsor Columbus on a voyage of exploration and sold her personal jewelry to do so. Columbus obtained three ships, La Niña, La Pinta, y La Santa Maria. The total crew was about 90 men. The fleet sailed on August 3, 1492 from the little port of Palos. On the morning of October 12th, the lookout of the Pinta called, called out Tierra La Vista, land in sight. Columbus had landed on a small island in the Bahamas. Columbus renamed it San Salvador, Holy Savior. Not knowing where he was, and always assuming he had reached Asia, the Indies, Columbus called the Native Americans Indians. During his four voyages from Spain to the Americas, Columbus believed he had found an unexplored part of the continent Asia. He believed this until his death in 1506. Another explorer, Amerigo Vespucci, made four voyages to this land. He realized that this was a new, unknown land and simply called it the New World. Vespucci wrote letters to his friends describing the New World. A dishonest author got hold of these letters, rewrote them, and published them in a book. This book found its way into the hands of a German mapmaker, who decided to call this new land after America. Columbus, hero or villain? Spread humanity, first European colonies, brought spices and riches to Europe, brought art, music, religion, science, me and medicine to America. Millions of deaths due to diseases such as smallpox, slavery.